Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Before we start, we would like to thank you all for the support you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to make psychology and mental health more accessible to everyone, and you help us do that. Now, let's begin. Are you aware of how you treat others? Do you often reflect on your behavior and find positive ways to improve? Being self-aware means that you're mindful of your own feelings and behaviors. People who are self-aware tend to know how they interact with their environment and other people on a daily basis. But sometimes it can be hard to step back and be aware of your relationship with yourself and others. So, here are 10 things only self-aware people do. Number one, you choose your words wisely. Have you ever heard of the saying, think before you speak? It's about choosing your words wisely and knowing when or when not to say something. While it doesn't mean that you should deliberate over every word or blurt out anything that comes to your head, it's important to keep in mind the things you're saying. Being self-aware is to be able to speak carefully and calmly to communicate what you really mean, which can help build better relationships and healthier habits. Two, you aren't afraid of new ideas. Do you dismiss your friends' beliefs or ideas without thinking? Self-awareness includes the ability and willingness to listen and understand people with different views. Listening to opposing or different views can help force you to explain, support, and reflect on your own ideas. This can help you take into consideration other people's ideas as well as help you become more aware of your own. Number three, you manage your time well. Do you procrastinate when it comes to huge assignments or projects? While it's not easy to learn, time management is a crucial and applicable skill to have in your everyday life. People who are self-aware know their strengths and weaknesses, and so are able to estimate how long their tasks will take them to complete. This awareness helps them plan ahead of time and prioritize their assignments well. Number four, you journal. Have you tried writing down what you did or felt in a notebook? Studies have shown that journaling can help you worry less about your stressful tasks and identify the causes of your unhappiness. Oftentimes, you may end up bottling up overwhelming emotions or thoughts because you couldn't express them throughout your day. Journaling, therefore, can serve as an outlet for your emotions so that you can better comprehend and be aware of your mindset. Number five, you practice patience. Are you easily irritated by traffic jams and long lines? Do you make impulsive decisions when your patience wears thin? Being able to wait for things without anger or frustration is a vital skill to have. It can help you become more aware of your mindset and understand your emotions so that you can avoid making impulsive choices under stress. Number six, you use empathy. Do people often tell you about their problems? Do you care deeply and think about how they feel? Being self-aware is not just about understanding yourself but also about your ability to sense how your actions affect other people. Empathy is important for self-awareness because it helps build stronger social connections and helps you increase your compassion towards others. Number seven, you accept your failures. Do you own up to your mistakes and apologize when necessary? People who are self-aware learn from their mistakes to grow and improve. If you make excuses for your failures, it only goes to show that you're unable to understand your own strengths and weaknesses. Being self-aware means that you know the limits of your abilities and are able to find ways to improve and grow to become better. Eight, you are humble. Do you often refrain from showing off your talents unless asked? People who are self-aware avoid the need to show how confident they are in their abilities. They're aware of their strengths and weaknesses and don't need to go out of their way to boast. Humbleness is important because it improves self-control, leadership skills, and work performance. Number nine, you ask for feedback. Are you scared to show other people your work? Or have you tried asking your friends or teachers about the ways you could improve? Whether it's your work, performance, or general personality, people who are self-aware often ask others for feedback. By asking questions you're usually afraid to answer yourself, you may actually find yourself receiving helpful feedback, which can help you grow as a person. And number 10, you talk to yourself. Do you talk to yourself when you're going through your tasks? According to Live Science, saying things out loud sparks memory and helps make the end goal appear tangible. Furthermore, according to psychologist Linda Sapidin, talking out loud to yourself helps you validate important and difficult decisions. So people who are self-aware are better able to organize their thoughts and remember important events. Do you now believe you're someone who's self-aware? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share it with others who may find it helpful too. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell icon for more Psych2Go content.
All the references used are also added in the description box below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in our next video.